Hey, in today's video I'm going to show you how to properly bleed or burp your coolant system. Let's say you did a radiator change or you had a bad leak and you want to make sure that there's no air pockets in the system otherwise it can cause you to overheat. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how to uh, conduct it. Alright, first thing you want to do is you want to identify your filler cap and your upper radiator hose. Alright, and from there, let's see if I can get this to stay upright. So what you want to do is take off your coolant filler cap. All right. Get you some of that there coolant. I don't have a funnel on me at this time. Just be careful. Stuff stinks it when you burn it off. All right. So you, what you're going to do is you're going to top off the radiator as much as you can. Okay. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to squeeze this hose. Alright. Those bubbles you're hearing are in the system. So I'm going to continue doing this until it fills without any more bubbles. And then I'm going to repeat the process with the vehicle turned on. This just cuts down the time you have to mess with it while vehicle is running. Let's see if this is it again. Just be careful not to make it go over. And I already done this a couple of times prior to filming so it might be good. some bubbles in there. See, I'm pinching it. Let it go, and it went down. So, again, just keep repeating the process until you fill up the radiator. Keep squeezing it. Let the bubbles come out. Uh, fill it up. Once you don't see any more bubbles, start the car. Do this one or two more times just to ensure there's no more bubbles in there. And then, uh, Cap it back off and you're good to go. Hope you all enjoyed.